London calling for the second away game in a row. A seventh and final league visit to the capital of the campaign. Southeast and North produced no points. West of here, much more fruitful. But the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium has relatively happy memories. Two wins in four previous visits, both of them inspired by Raul Jimenez. So timely for the return of this season's goal-scoring inspiration, He Chan Wang. His return from Asia Cup duty and injury most welcome with the absence of informed Mateus Cunha. Spurs come forward to the ball, Davis Madison steps over with Charleston in the penalty area, but his fellow Brazilian Chao Gomez got there and scoops the ball away. Son on the left-hand side, fizzes his cross in and Dawson heads it high into the air. Jose Sarr comes and claims on the edge of the six-yard box. Of course, it does mean lots of players committed forwards and Wolves have got possession. Here's he Chan Wang driving over the halfway line. Sarabia has it, 25 yards from goal, lines up a shot from distance, awkward bounce in front of the keeper, but a comfortable take. Dawson battling with Richarlison and this time, oh no, he's telling Richarlison to get up. Wolves play on, Sarabia, Semedo to his right hand side of the penalty, oh, Semedo shot, so he turned Wang with a follow-up and he scoops it over the top of the crossbar from five yards out as Tottenham still complain to referee Anthony Taylor. That is a glorious chance missed by the South Korean. Being forced backwards by Lamina, good toe in on the ball. Wang to eight Nuri, Sarabi has made a great break to the right, it goes to the left hand side to Neto, Wolves have a four on four here as the cross comes in towards Sarabi on the edge of the box, gets it back onto his left foot, tees it up, eight Nuri has to drag it back onto his left, now onto his right again, trying to curl it and the goalkeeper diving to his left hand side claims. Totti away from Kulusevski who had a grip at his shirt. And threading an excellent pass through to He Chen Wang. Left hand side of the penalty area. Wang back onto his right foot, waiting for support. Xiao Gomez teeing it up here for Semedo to strike in. It's closed in and blocked by Basuma, and the offside flag has gone up anyway. Takes the corner short to Neto on the left hand side. Pulled back to Ainuri. Out of his feet. Looks to whip across in. Nobody actually made the movement, and it comes off Richarlison and will be another Wolves corner. Actually, was a really good ball in. In swinging delivery, this one will come straight in from Sarabia from the right. It's a great delivery, Xiao Gomez is headed, it's in! Xiao Gomez scores! Wolves lead at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium! An unexpected scorer, but delight in the away end! Tottenham Hotspur nil, Wolverhampton Wanderers won. Who would have predicted Xiao Gomez to head home? That's an unbelievably timed header, perfect. He's literally hit it at the peak of the ball and directed it right into the top far corner. The keeper couldn't have done anything with it, but what a goal that is. Great finish and great to see a score from a corner. Here's Emerson Royale. Xiao Gomez in with the challenge. Wolves have won it back. Neto takes it from him. He's getting support from Totti on the overlap, just a touch of Pape Matasar, but Totti has time, oh, he skips back in field away from the challenge, and past the second, now pulling it back to Eight Nuri. Eight Nuri just hesitates, pulls it in field to Dawson, Dawson clips across, they're queuing up, Sarabia, oh my word, what a save by Vicario, flying to his right-hand side, that is unbelievable, oh, just... the offside flag's gone up anyway. Oh. Still got two minutes of time being added on. Here comes Madison out to Son. Left hand side of the penalty area to Davis on the overlap. Low one in and blocked off at the near post and scrambled behind by Dawson for a corner. Neto with an early cross in, stooping header away by Davis. Eight Nuri's across. Sarabia's over on the right hand side into the penalty area. Sarabia to try and curl it towards the far post and couldn't get it on target. Tally, it's that kind of stadium where there's so many fans who are not back in their seats yet. As Lorena goes in with a crunching challenge and Kulusevski running and scoring. And Spurs are right back in it, right at the start of the second half. Wolves allowed him to drift through from a tight angle and he squeezes it under Jose Sarr. 
It's two in the wall. Madison sweeps it to the left hand side to Son. Up against Semedo. Left hand side of the penalty area. Low cross in taken by Jose Sarr. Back to Dawson. And Dawson hitting a sweep. Crossfield diagonal taken nicely by Semedo. Early cross. Sarabia. Brilliant save by the goalkeeper. Flag didn't go up. Oh. It's a corner. Oh my gosh. What. What an incredible ball from Craig Dawson. That's the moment that opens them up. That little bit of confidence, but I'm not sure whether it was off or not, but it's a fantastic ball and then a great early pass as well. I think ooh, I think he's possibly all right. That felt close. Neto launching across in deep. Kilman trying to get round the back post, came off him last. Son, infield to Basuma, 25 yards from goal, looking for Madison. Struck brilliantly here and brilliantly saved. Kulusevsky's left-footed effort and Jose Sarr flying to his left-hand side. He was heading towards the bottom corner and he tipped it around the post for a corner. All the play inside the Wolves' half at the moment. Much of it in the final third. Son, in-swinging cross. It's flicked and it's going to be Kulusevsky arriving and it's a brilliant block by Semedo. Everybody back to defend. Madison's in swinging delivery from the left-hand side. Nate Nuri heading to the edge of the box. Now Chao Gomez releasing Pedro Neto, driving Wolves downfield. Neto might choose to go in alone here. Into the penalty area he is on his right foot, trying to check back on his left, pulling it back. It's Chao Gomez! Oh, he's got two! Chao Gomez arriving, perfectly timed, and Wolves are back in front at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Oh my gosh, what a finish that is under pressure. Unbelievable run from Neto, another assist for him. He's just done the unbelievable, managed to keep his footing as he's turned back inside and picked out with a very firm pass, uh, Jao Gomez, who has managed to control it and hit the target and absolutely broke the back of the net. Completely against the run of play. It's a wonderful goal, Pedro Neto's driving run. He's run almost the length of the field from a Tottenham corner. Wolves get it clear to the edge of the box. It was Xiao Gomez who starts the attack and he doesn't just stand and watch. He puts his head down and he drives downfield and he watches Neto cause all sorts of havoc, cuts back in field and there he is just behind the penalty spot. It's a wonderful finish. Infield to Madison, 25 yards from goal. Son, left-hand corner of the box. Back infield to Madison, time to shoot, and it's just over the top. Jose Sarr will feel like he had it watched all the way. Neto trying to put pressure on, and Huang might just get there, and he does get to the loose ball, just ahead of Werner. Now trying to release Neto, and he's got two runners in the middle. Neto looking up, squaring it for Belgar. Belgar, it's the penalty on his right foot, back onto his left. Oh, he couldn't get the strike away, he was blocked in the end just seemed to wait an age for the ball to reach him and then did he take too long to try and get his shot in Chao Gomez has one arm in the air wants it again I bet he'll be well marshalled on this one Neto left footed from the right hand side in swinging delivery deep to the far post Lamina heading back into the danger zone Tottenham foot there Dawson trying to keep it alive he's done brilliantly Lamina on the volley and it's taken by the goalkeeper at the near post that would have been some goal now for Romero, 30 yards from goal, infield to Hoybier. Buba Traore got a touch to it, Wolves can try and launch a counter. Belgar trying to play it on here for Pedro Neto. Neto driving on, 30 yards from goal, 25, up to the edge of the box. Neto tries to go for glory and hits it behind and ends up going down. Less than two minutes left to play. Oh my gosh. Is that cramp? Or hopefully more I, than that than I just think hamstring. It'll be cramp. I think it'll be cramp. In the end, gets it back from Totti, and now to Lamina. Nice little flick from Xiao Gomez, here's Belgar, left-hand side of the penalty area, clipping across in, Neto oh. on the volley. Oh, he got it horribly wrong, oh. horribly wrong, and it went out of play by the corner flag. Eight Nuri trying to get the block on him, Kulusevsky pulling it backwards in field to Bentancur, Bentancur turning back onto his right foot, looking again to Kulusevsky, onto his left, clipping his cross in, Davis's free header, and he heads it well, well wide. And a huge sigh of relief from the away end. Oh my gosh, I'm literally struggling to breathe here. This is so, 
you know, it's a real tough watch to end the game, but I think it's a jump from either Dawson or maybe Totty go Dawson just in front was never getting the ball, but I think that leap actually just about put him off because he didn't know where the ball was coming from. Belgar nearly with a flick on. Bubakar Traore with nearly with the ball through to Aitnuri. The game of nearly is there for Wolves as Semedo plays it forwards. Aitnuri, flag has stayed down. Aitnuri on here to Doherty into the penalty. It's Matt Doherty who fires it wide and offside flag goes up eventually. We're into added time of added time. That would have been some story. All eyes on Anthony Taylor. Ball comes back again to Hoybier. Wide to Johnson. Johnson setting himself, trying to cut back in field. He goes down in the box. It's picked up by Lo Celso. Ball backwards. Hoybier's cross into the danger zone. There's time. Wolves have more time than they realise. Semedo will turn and smash it clear. And the referee blows the final whistle. And Wolves have won in the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium for the third time in five visits. A second win in London in two away trips. It's another remarkable victory for Gary O'Neill's team. Under the cost for so, so long, they got themselves in front from Shao Gomez's header three minutes before half-time. Spurs were back level within a minute of the restart as Dejan Kulusevski poked it through the legs of Jose Sarr. It was all Spurs in that period, but Wolves on the counter-attack thanks to a blistering run by Pedro Neto and an assured finish from Shao Gomez, his second of the game. He's got two today, three for the club. It's a remarkable result. It's finished Spurs 1, Wolves 2. Goodness me, this team is fun to watch.